We're in Calgary Northwest today. This is a residential, quite a nice residential area, commercial area. And you can see this mall here. And there's another mall across the street there. And we got a community center over there. So we have some concerns. You see on top of this mall, there's quite an extensive rooftop cellar tower system. And I'm just gonna zoom into it so you can see all the antennas right there up above. There's some more. So the owner of this place is profiting from the deployment of these antennas. There's some more there. There's quite quite a lot up there. And there's that one right there pointing that direction. See that? back over here some more right there so we're going to do a reading to see what's going on oh my god this thing is peeking out So we're going as high as 3.5, 3.69, 4, 4.5 pulsating, 5.3. That's volts per meter. Adverse health effects start at 0 0.5. And then we got the, the thermal on the right hand side, microwatts per square meter. We're going up to over 5,000 pulsating. So this is extreme EMF radiation zone according to the bio initiative. Extreme EMF starts at 0.693.693 and we're in the upper extreme levels 5.15, 5.15, 5.28, pulsating there. We're just going to walk over here. There's something else you need to see. We got a tower right there. Right between the trees here. So this tower has 4G antennas at the top. And during the lockdown, 5G antennas were deployed on the lower level of this tower. So we're getting pretty extreme. Again, we're in the extreme range. It's not maxing out, but it's still extreme. Let's go over here. We're gonna give you a close look at these 5G antennas they deployed. We don't think they are operational yet. They're working through the 4G.
can see the residential area here. There it is there. So this is pretty extreme readings. The mall area was a little higher, but this is still pretty extreme for a public area. It's going up to 5.53, nearly maxing out, pulsating. And over 2,400, 2,500, 2,600 thermal microwatts per square meter. The bio initiative said public areas should be at maximum 1,000. Health Canada through safety code six allows up to 10 million microwatts per square meter. This is outrageous. In terms of volts per meter, Health Canada through safety code six allows 27.63 volts per meter, which is unbelievably extreme. There's the tower there. We're gonna we're gonna walk down. We want to give you a close look of those an, antennas. And there's another tower right there. I'm seeing right between these trees. See it there? And that's right in another mall area. Look at that right there. That monstrosity. These towers are popping up everywhere without doing the proper safety testing on them. There's a community center right here. So this tower right here is on City of Calgary property. The city is profiting from the, from the contamination of EMF radiation in this area. They're making money off it. It's hard to say how much they're making per month off this tower. It could be a thousand or more a month. Those look like very powerful 5G antennas. They're quite small. You get a look at them right there. See them? So this is a water pump station. That's the property it's on. It's part of the city of Calgary. You can see it right here. There's the community center. We got houses in direct line of travel of this tower right there. Wow, look at that. 
this premises is under 24-7 surveillance. I wonder why that's the case. What are they worried about? Here's these antennas up here. We get a lot of questions about 5G antennas, so this is a good example. Right there. See that? And these were deployed during the lockdown onto this monopole tower. We don't think they're fully activated. We think they're working within the 4G spectrum, the antennas above. So we're going to have to monitor the site. We're very concerned of what's going on in Canada and throughout the world with this 5G deployment. There hasn't been proper safety testing done. It's uh, adding more and more EMMF radiation into our environment and there's severe biological effects on humans and all other living beings, trees, insects, bees, animals, you name it. So we encourage people to question, check out National Citizens Alliance for more information. We're not against technology at NCA, but we do not support the reckless deployment of technology that has the potential for serious health effects. And we know there are serious privacy impacts from this technology through what's called the 5G AI world technocracy. We're very concerned. So please get informed, take ownership of your environment, be aware of your environment, ask questions.